White, Gabe, Toth, Chris, Liu, Firo, and Panga Beam from Indonesia. Toth in three, the Hungarian is 24, already has a bronze in the 100 free and multiple medals in London four years ago. Crisp from Great Britain was 33. He was the silver medalist in London and silver medal at the Worlds, won the gold in this event in Sydney. And Liu Xiaobing, the bronze medalist from London, he's now 26. The Brazilian you can see on your screen as well. So more to cheer for for the local crowd. Andre Garbi, he's 19. So White, Garbe, Toth, Crisp, Lu, Biro, and Panga Bean. So just a slight delay at the start there. Well, Chris was very high on the side of the pool and arched his back into the water, but he didn't make the most of the underwater. And it's actually Toth in lane three who had a beautiful glide and made the most of it before he broke water. And now he's up and stroking most likely in first position. But Furo, who is down in lane six, is also cruising pretty well. But it does look as though Toth is managing to build a modest lead as they head into the first turn. He'll may almost have half a body length on the rest of the field. Well, Toth is looking very good. He does get off to very good starts, but does he have enough in the back end? He, somebody who is used to swimming in these distances, but more of a freestyle specialist, although this is one of his preferred events. So Toth is looking to hold on. In fact, even extending his advantage here over Crisp and uh, Liu of uh, People's Republic of China. So between Crisp and Liu for uh, the second touch in this pool, but they both have fight in them and will come back strong. Toth, is he fading? Oh, it looks like he might while Garby is looking strong in lane two. Well, it's Liu who's had a fantastic backhand 50. He may well touch in first. There's not going to be much in it between Liu and Chris, but touch in it, it's Chris. He got there. Liu's just had about a quarter of a stroke to get there, touching in just behind. And what a performance, particularly in that final 25. There was They were trailing Toth by a substantial margin, about three quarters of a body length. But uh, both swimmers perhaps sensing each other side by side, really pushed right to the wall. So the time in heat two is 1.05. It was a great underwater from uh, Toth. Chris swam the smart race. He's very experienced, this James Crisp. He's uh, been there and thereabouts in this event for the better part of two decades. Now at 33, he was a world champion as far back as 18 years ago in New Zealand. And Chris just timed his stroke to perfection at the wall. Hand touches perfectly, and it was down to that touch that sees him taking the uh, victory in heat two. Well, it looks as though they've swum an identical time, Chris and Biscuit, Biscuit in the first heat look at that 105 flat <laughs> one and two so that's setting up a very interesting final indeed and really not a lot splitting the top six swimmers who've gone through less than a second